After breast augmentation, the post-op care varies uh, somewhat from surgeon to surgeon, but one of the things that you have to be careful of is allowing the implant to ride up and sit high. Things are very tight down here when you put a breast implant in, and that tight tissue tends to make the implant sit too high, and it can take a long time for that to stretch and drop down. So most plastic surgeons today use what's called a bandeau. It's a white elastic strap that runs across the top of the implants and kind of holds them down for the first week. At least the first week for me. I've, after the first week, they should be kind of down where they're supposed to be. Um, some people may use it longer, but that seems to work okay. The other issue is bleeding. And so the first week after surgery, really the first two weeks, bleeding is the biggest issue. And so what I personally use is an ACE bandage, like a six inch wide ACE bandage wrapped around the chest to provide compression. So that compression along with a strap on the top holds the implants, provides pressure, kind of keeps things from, uh, from going south in that first week to two weeks. After that, it's all about tissue stretch and that's a nine month process for the implants. And I, I've seen several places on the internet where people talk about the drop and fluff it's really your tissue stretching. The implants are already dropped, but where the muscle was really swollen, it fades and makes it look like things have dropped down. That's about a six week process before you get a good shape.